All right, so we got Suicide Squad killed the Justice League. Suicide Squad Insider 1. So we got the video. Ah! When is this game coming out, by the way? Because I've been waiting a long time for this game to come out. Rocksteady Studios, huh? Okay. My name is Axel Ridby, and I'm the game director here. Eyes up, people! Let's go. At Rocksteady, storytelling and character depth are the core DNA of our game. I can't These lie. Features, but Rocksteady fundamentals. This looks really nice, Suicide but I want a game. date. We wanted to tell a new story. We wanted to expand the Arkham verse. Arkham Asylum. That's where all you ministers go. Just from his lens. Now getting to see the world through the villain's eyes Wait. was really the hook for us. I got a question. Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League is a third-person action shooter that can be played solo or with your friends. Oh my god, wait a minute. The, oh my, the fighting looks crazy. That highlights Rocksteady's experience in bringing characters to life. As a Suicide Squad, you'll be wait. forced to take on an absolute impossible mission. You must kill the Justice League. I got a question, though. We want the mechanics of the game to really reflect the personality. Is this going to include oh, like Batman so Arkham, like Batman Arkham boy, Batman, like that bat, like honest. that Batman? Let's make like cheap chewing gum and not stick around. Now our four members of Task Force X find themselves inside Metropolis. At twice the and you got to kill Wonder, Wonder Woman too. Night. Wonder Woman's a demon, bro. She's a menace. A battlefield. It's a place built for verticality, mobility, the unique fusion of enhanced traversal, gunplay, and melee weapons. This looks good. I can't lie to you. That we think is a totally original gameplay experience. There was just an opportunity there to expand into co-op and have this dynamic world where friends can come together to share an experience. Or players can go solo, switching character members between missions while savoring each and every story twist. Do you feel it? The swell of pride for what we have accomplished. Hey, you know that man breath kicking. We welcome you all to hey, you know that shark breath kicking. Is Suicide Squad Insider, where we will provide a deeper look into Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League. Over the next few months, we'll be unpacking the game. Hey, I can't lie, bro. Batman looked like a straight demon, bro. Demon hooligan. He looks like a straight school threat, bro. Look how good this looks. Do y'all see this? You're going to hear from different members of the Rocksteady team as we explore more of the game story, the world of Metropolis, and the core gameplay experience. The Suicide Squad. A fitting moniker. Let's jump into it. Wait, is that Deathstroke? Is that his name? Deathstroke? Normally when you make a game in a superhero universe, the protagonist is the best person for the job. Yeah, the obviously. The squad are definitely not the best people for this job. They're the only people available. Hey, Suicide Squad! Fuck you! <laughs> so it gives the narrative and the gameplay a kind of frantic slightly panicked feeling where they are trying to figure this out as they go the arkham games weren't gritty because rocksteady makes gritty dark games they were that way because that's what suits a batman story true every game we approach we approach that with a similar mindset of just like how do we enhance that experience how do we excite players in new so ways? no one of the care pushing this back for the studio to try something new and stretch our legs, or they shoot first and with the high powerful traversal elements, was coming out of our comfort zone. Somewhere. Hey, I but can't lie to you, this looks really nice, bro. Arkham spin on the action like the color, the everything. Oh my Get goodness. In true Rocksteady style, the cinematics are kind of the heart of our story. It's the most cinematics that we've ever done, and every one of is them that the is crafted one? to perfection. <laughs> we're not just trying to do what we did before, we're making something which fits the source material that we think will make for an interesting story, but will oh. feel different. So I'm guessing they're taking like a lot of the villains from like the Batman Arkham, story, like Arkham games. Part of the game. Um, from here, Amanda like, from there, the and put them in the here. Government agency Argus sends the team behind enemy lines into Metropolis. Harley Quinn, should you not be more cautious? She ain't wired that way. Facts. Oh, dead shot. Hidden in an underground train oh, station. Oh, dead shot. That's his name. Elevator. I thought it was Deathstroke. Until we figure out where the hell we are, let's play along with Mahler. Oh, is this a superhero museum? <laughs> Hate superheroes. Oh, well, we know. And museums. <clears throat> I've seen it on TV. I can't lie, but that looks nice. So let's rock the place. Bro, how are they about to beat them? Bro, that's Superman, Batman, Wonder Woman, Green Lantern. 
in the flash. How are you about to beat that team? Through these doors lies the inner sanctum of the Justice League. Sounds very grand, doesn't it? And it is. Okay, nah, in real life. And that's Batman Arkham Batman, bro. That man's a nuisance. Cause you know y'all know he hold back. I ain't fighting any supers for you. I have read much about the Justice League. And still And I think uh the goat Kevin Convoy, I think he vote he voices Batman in this one. Rest in peace to Kevin Convoy, bro. That man's a goat. And if I said his last name wrong, then my bad. I'm sorry about that. You can steal their gadgets? Hey man, watch the ah, shit. Glass. I'm okay. What the hell you got there? Thought this baby was a myth. Speed force gauntlet. Back when Doc Savannah tried to lift Flash's gimmick. <laughs> oh, they got Harley Quinn. <sighs> myth Garrett. Like they just stealing, they just stealing gadgets. Like, look at these menaces. This looks good, though. I can't lie to you. You found the Riddler's hat of invisibility. <laughs> the Riddler. <laughs> Man, take that. Th you cannot fit that. Take that thing off. <laughs> Bro, like an old mafia gangster. Like a freaking jetpack. Shit, I'd break my damn neck. You're probably right. Jetpacks seem more like a death stroke thing, anyway. Oh, so it is death stroke. Death shot, death stroke, whatever. <laughs> I don't know what to call them. Man, you know you're too heavy for that jetpack, bro. Look at these heathens stealing. This looks good, though. I cannot lie to you. That uh, hat's not gonna get you vertical, shot. Yeah, bro. Take. I can make my own way up. You gonna take? You gonna take the Riddler's hat off? No, that's the Riddler, right? on that roof and get our freedom back free them brother y'all are villains y'all supposed to stay behind doors hey but listen this is a new game so let it rock you don't typically traverse the way they do in our game but that's the beauty of our storytelling we've okay, managed to take these unique minute. abilities and make that an extension of their personalities man look at the boat y'all see the graphics Y'all see like the little effects, bro? Every time like they're running and jumping off of buildings and stuff. We loved working with Gotham and making that a world for players to experience. And we wanted to do that with a new location. What new location is this? Good to get out of that. Send me your location, then. What location is this? We felt that Metropolis was the natural next step to extend. Oh, okay, Metropolis. Okay. And what better way to introduce it than through an invasion from Brainiac with no Justice League to save them? Just checking. We're all seeing that thing, right? Yeah. The entire game is about fighting behind enemy lines. Oi, Wally! What the hell have you set us into? It's a bloody war zone out here. There's a giant skull in the sky. Congratulations, Task Force X. Oh my god. You're the first assets to make it into Metropolis alive. We're sending a signal transponder to your location. So you're essentially bringing the I hit him in a waller, bro. I hit him in a waller. That's sick. That's sick. I don't know what that's called. That little effects that she has on like on our on our weapons, but that's nice. What the hell are those things? 
and there's no civilians left. Brainiacs killed them or made them into soldiers to do his bidding. This man, Brainiacs, this went crazy. Metropolis have become extensions of Brainiac. So what? Like the the so the Suicide Squad are like the like the new heroes now. Are they? Are they like? Hey ooh, guys, ooh, ooh, give me your soul. Green Lantern. What the player knows from our title and what the Suicide Squad is about to find out is that here, the Justice League are the bad guys. They've been corrupted by Brainiac, and over the course of the game, your mission will be to kill them. Uh, Tough. Nice. Hey, your face always looks so. What? Harley doesn't have any innate superpowers, so to go up against these beings that have incredible strength, it's it's a challenge. I'm in the middle of a recon for Brady. Let's go. <laughs> you look like Shannon Sharp. <laughs> <laughs> about the, you know, the all-star team of superheroes here. I want you to Samoa Joe! <laughs> oh. Looks bad. Feels worse. But once you've been enhanced, there's no going back. Oh, we know. When you face off against the most iconic characters in all of superhero them in Justice League, it's by many... Well, what is Samoa Joe doing? He's a wrestler, top. right? That's crazy. Shout out to Samoa Joe. Augmenting Brainiac Army. The shot gets it. The stakes that Rocksteady sets, the challenges. Scott Porter. He sounds very familiar. Time to rally up with Brainiac. Ready to make the leap? You know immediately, like, this is the tallest task I will ever take on in a video game. Look at the Flash. Flash. Brainiac wondered how you got off the ship. Speedster secret. The league doesn't leave anyone behind. Let's make you right, buddy. You know, that's just what I was gonna say. Well, not, gonna that man's right too fat. You're, you're not, you're not being him. There's nothing more high stakes than the boss battles we have in this game. These are gods oh, like Green Lantern, Batman, God. Superman, the Flash. Bro, bro, Batman about to be the hardest boss so, battle, bro. What's the plan? That point, the game really. Bro, because up. that Batman is actually players, like gonna kill, bro. Weaponry. That Batman is a menace, bro. How am I gonna kill the Justice League? Yeah, looking forward to killing the Justice League and all, but, uh, well, you know, these guns are a bit shit. Oh, no offense. <laughs> Been head northwest. That's the last known of a Gotham arms dealer who's dug into Metropolis. Oswald Cobblepot. Uh-oh, the menace. The penguin. You want to last more than 10 seconds against the league? Cobblepot's been running anti-meta weapons for years. Bro, this man, Oswald. recruited and brought back to the Hall of Justice. Oh, I'm gonna recruit the shit out of him. Oh. Since Batman Arkham Knight, the Penguin is no longer confined to Gotham City. He's made a name for himself in Metropolis. Yeah, this man, what, this man moved from Gotham to Metropolis. Metropolis. Now, Waller wants the squad to recruit him for Argus. I see you've already stolen traversal equipment. You'll need it to stay off the streets. Setting a new recon point. Well, oh. that is hard. All each character's play style is their traversal. Traversal gives the player total freedom. Every character has their own way of getting around that determines how the player moves through this world. Oh. Don't like to boast, but how great was I? Bro, hey, bro, I can't lie, the movement is fire. What's going on? I didn't know the movement was like, huh? Hey, the movement is really impressive, bro. Well, as normal as a city can be in the DC universe. We spend a lot of time trying to get that art direction correct, trying to get the feel for it correct. You get to see all the kind of DC lore that builds. Oh my God! You guys see like the color, like whenever she's swinging, she has like color dragging from her. That is so nice, bro. Not just a building; it's a daily planet. You know, there's a lot we can inject into the city that makes it more than just a city. Oh, penguin oh, is not truly a penguin. Yeah, mate. And I'm not a boomerang. True. It is known for its size, its scale. I wonder if, uh, if like, if like Jimmy Olsen will like be in here, or like Lois Lane will be in this game. Cause let's be honest, bro. If Lois Lane gets hurt in this game, bro, that man Batman will go Super Saiyan times three, bro. It's just a great way for players to experience Metropolis in a new way. Ah, oh, they go to Penguin. Open up the door, bro. Penguin. This man, Penguin, always trying to sell something. Hey, Pengo. Remember me? 
<laughs> no. Ain't this a right rogues gallery? Penguin. Who's a big bleeder? Figure's cousin used to work for me. Ooh. Which one? Uh, both come out of a circus. <laughs> We're getting the hell out of the city before Argus finds us. You in? But we are working for Argus. You bloody what? Real slick, Shark. <laughs> Good talk. Nice catching up. Get nice catching up. <laughs> <laughs> Time to break in. Traversal is at the very core of our game. You will need to be on the move and master each character's movements if you want to succeed. Well, you got to master each character's movements? Take advantage of the environment to quickly get out of Penguin, you call the cops? Or she can use it to quickly close the distance to introduce them to her baseball bat. Hey, I can't lie, bro. Harley's like quick, bro. Let's her circumvent the trooper's shield. She's very agile, and I I would imagine that like every villain in the in the um, in the Justice League, I imagine they all got like different attributes. So like, the shark dude, I'm guessing he's probably really strong. He had like a lot of power. Let's explore the rest of the squad's unique play styles in other encounters. Captain Boomerang uses a mix between sniper rifles, SMGs, and shotguns. Okay. Each character has an iconic melee attack that can be used to. I'm gonna be honest. I don't know that shark dude. I know Boomerang. I know Harley Quinn. I know uh, Death Shot or Death Stroke. I don't know the shark dude. I, know, I, don't, I never. Shoot enemies in their legs and then close the distance to do a shield harvesting strike to get some shield back. Mm, okay. Let's shift focus to King Shark. Ah, oh, King Shark. I, I, King Shark is literally death from above, which he gladly shows with his Atlantean drop attack. Oh my. He's the character that can take the most punishment. Heavy weapons, assault rifles, and shotguns, and his trusted cleavers, sickles, and I can't lie. Hey, rolling. King Shark, he might be, he might be the, the one. Bigger enemies, each character gets a super powerful single target attack. Hey, King this Shark might be the one for me. One shots any enemy hit, but it takes longer to recharge. So Ooh, it's bro, this game looks so damn Finally, colorful. Oh my god. See, you're low caliber, and I'm high caliber. His traversal is made to let him create his own vantage point. Brother. This works great with his weapon loadout, sniper rifles, assault rifles, and pistols. Obviously, it's, it's death shot. Dead shot relies on his iconic Oh, death shot. Okay. I, really I'm getting the names the wrong. I'm so sorry, y'all. I thought it was death stroke. Uh, it's it it's dead shot. I'm sorry. And shooter gameplay. Introducing counter shot. Each enemy has a different reaction to the counter Ooh. shot. Bro, the stunned, bro, oh my god, it's like, damage, some will be bro, the color is so really like, annoyed. it's now like catching my eye, eye. oh my god, I love it. Forces with all these tools. They got animations? Bible by man, do we have a job for you? Tell him, Quinn. You're making guns for us now, bird brain. <laughs> Thanks for joining us. Bad brain. Suicide squad insider. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Harley. What? I already started, so I followed through. Yo, you're In the months crazy. leading up to our launch from February 2nd, 2024. Harley, call me. Details and insights about Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League. Bro, I hey, I like uh, these animations, bro. I can't lie to you. Into more gameplay, combat mechanics, and how to take the fight to the enemy in your own unique style. I want to show you what happens next. Let's call it a sneak preview. Ooh, who was that? We really want players to feel like they explored all these characters that we bring to life in this DC universe. I'm going to enjoy that. This. Lex Luthor. Characters who aren't very powerful, and through the story. You're learning how to use their skills and become powerful. You really want to deep dive into the RPG system. You have your enhanced traversal, you have gunplay, you have weapons. There are upgrades and unique talents. And all of that stuff fusing together to create this kind of unique experience. Together, we are unstoppable. Join me. Are you kidding me? All right, February 2nd. That's the day before my birthday. February 2nd, 2024. That's the day before the kid's birthday. Here's what I'm going to say. First of all, hey, 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 King Shark. This, <laughs> hey, you might, <laughs> hey, this little big show attire right here, put it up. Um, <laughs> other than that, man, listen, I'm excited. I think 
I, I think I know the reason why they push this game back so much, right? And I, well, not so much. I, I I did hear that they did push this game back like once or twice, um. But I'm glad they did, bro, because looking at this stuff right here, bro, looking at like the cutscenes, looking at the gameplay. First of all, I'm so impressed with the gameplay. I'm impressed with like the movement. I'm impressed with the color. I tell you all the time, bro. I'm like I'm so addicted to color. Like I'm like, I'm so like I don't know the gaming term. But, like, whenever, like, games have, like, the flashing color and, and they have, like, all the effects to, like, every movement of a, uh, of a character or whatever, I love that so much. I don't know what, like, what it's called or, or, or something like that, but I love it. So, like, this, like, the color off of, like, them about to do it, like, do an attack, bro, I'm, I love that so much. Um, other than that, man, I'm, I'm just excited for the game to come out. I'm going to be honest. I, I've been waiting for a long time. It's coming out. We finally got a, um, we finally got a release date, which is really nice, February 2nd. Uh, it's actually crazy. If it would have been February third, that would have been absolutely insane. But um, honestly, bro, they got they got the penguin in here. Now I don't know if this is going to be the penguin from the original uh, Batman Arkham, uh, Batman Arkham Knight, Batman Arkham City, whatever. Um, but yeah, it, it was just a surprise that like they got a lot of you know people in here. They got Lex Luthor in here. Um, they got um, penguin in here. They got Batman, Superman, Wonder Woman. This is the whole basically the whole Justice League, obviously. Um, but yeah, it's, it's just crazy. Like looking at the, like the, the design and stuff like that. I'm really impressed, man. Shout out to, um, oh my God. What was it? R Rocksteady? Is is, it, is that their company? Rocksteady? If I said your name wrong, I'm so sorry. Let me, let me see. Hold on. Let me, let me, let me see if I can. Is it Rocksteady? Hold on. Let me, cause I don't want to get the name wrong and try to disrespect. I don't like that a lot. Um, but yeah, um, I, I'm super impressed. I'm very impressed. Um, looking at like the character model stuff like that, man. I just can't wait to the game coming out. Listen, I've been waiting for a long time for this game to come out. Ever since they released a trailer at the Game Awards last year, um, I was just excited for this game to come out. So we finally got a date uh, for this game, and uh, yeah, I'm really excited, man. Comment down below. What do you guys think so far? I, they pretty much showed us like the first um, part. Well, not part, but they showed us like little sprinkles of like you know like the first. Uh, part of this game so again i'm excited comment down below what do you guys think about this video what do you guys think about uh suicide uh, i said suicide suicide ah suicide squad killed just glee other than that see you guys for next one i'm out and uh bye see ya